So a new era begins for England women at the T20 World Cup in Australia. Lisa Kitely taking over. Laura, what can we expect from this English side under new management? Um, I think it's a really exciting time for the team and, and for Lisa, obviously taking over and um, I guess transitioning um, from it with a new coach can be a tricky time, but I think I think what she'll bring to the side will be be what's needed and you know she obviously brings a um, a lot of experience coaching within the, the women's big bash um, she knows the conditions out in Australia really well and um, and she'll know a lot of the players as well. Now, England have beaten Australia in the build-up to the tournament obviously Australia are heavy favourites but what do England need to do to get that title it seems like a big ask against that Australian side. Um, I think I think any team that turns up on their day can 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 beat Australia and, and beat the other best teams in the world. I think it's, um, I guess it's about winning the key moments in the game and um, potentially something that we didn't do during the Ashes. Um, you know, we got ourselves into good positions, but we didn't quite win those key battles. And um, I think probably the matchups as well between players is going to be important. So, um, kind of trying to identify the the weaknesses of the Australian players and um, trying to find ways to combat those. Who's key for England? Which are the players that are going to produce the, the biggest all-round performances in this tournament? Uh, I think from a bowling point of view, probably Sophie Eccleston mm. is... Um, she's Heather's go-to, really, in, in lots of situations. Um, she's very skillful, she's consistent, and and she's a real fighter as well, so she'll she'll stand up in the big moments for the team. Batting-wise, they're going to move Tammy Beaumont down to six for this tournament. What do you make of that? Yeah, I think, I think it's a good move. It's not necessarily something she's used to, but... Um, I think her strength, particularly in one-day cricket, is, is her sort of grittiness and ability to play different situations. And so, England's chances, where do you think they're going to come in this tournament? Uh, I, think, I think certainly, well, I'd hope they get to the final. Um, I think they would be expecting to get to the final. And, um, yeah, as I said, if, you know, if they, t they turn up on the day and, and execute their skills, well, they can definitely beat Australia or, or, the, or any other team they're playing against. Excellent. Well, we'll see what Lisa Kitely can deliver in her first major tournament.